Well, well we've got, we've got, we've got five versions of the song Hatchet. Oh yeah, we can talk, new we can talk about and, that. And what we could do is listen to the first version, the version from the record. Yeah, we can do that. This will, this will, this will take up. This. And then we can listen to the uh, Retribution Gospel Choir. Oh okay, uh, yeah. Oh, okay. <coughs> and you can talk about something <coughs> relating to that. Okay, so song nine, we can play a little bit of that. This is this is Hatchet from Drums and Guns, which is the record we did recently. And once again, more drum machines. Oh, actually, oh, I can play oh, yeah, the sample. Here, we got the sample. sample here. Hold on. No, where is it? You mean? Oh, that's a good one. Should we hear Hollis for a second? Anybody recognize that? It's a loop. What is that? A, who said it? It's the stove. It's lighting the stove at the studio at when we made this record. Okay, play the play the tune. Line it up with this drum machine. And bass. And then it's really retarded guitar part. Do you really mean that, or do you? And I've wondered about the it's, guitar. It's part. a little, it's a little shaky. So you're talking about the way it's played, or the actual no, part? The way I play it. You be my Charlie, and I can be your George. Let's bury the hatchet like. And the stones They'll play our songs forever On the radio Let's bury the hatchet Like the Beatles I go to the next version The Beatles and the Stones I go to the next one So what's the next one? What do you, you can next one is, a, this is This was early on when I this first is This is when I first, first written the song this was recorded on this thing, yeah. Koslick's playing, he's playing guitar, second guitar on this. From Red House Painters? Yeah, a guy from Red House Painters. This was done in his, at his house. Let's bury the hatchet like And did you keep some of the, his guitar parts? Uh, did, huh? did, did he no, we were, just, we were just sitting around strumming through the song and just turned the thing on. Play the, play the next one. What's the, and the next one is the uh... next one. Uh, after we did the record, we went home and we needed a B side for this. Well, we wanted to do this thing, and it's the same song, but we did it on this player organ called the Octagon, which is this weird thing from the seventies, and and then I had Mim sing it. So that's this is this. It's the same song. I like it because, I mean, yeah, it's just, it's this weird keyboard called the Optagon. Uh, but, yeah, all the drum parts and the organ, the bass part, and stuff on this keyboard. It sounds like a soul record. So now, do you, did you have to track each, like the drums, do a track, and then do that? It was all. No, just was keyboard. Just sit and press, you know, G, E minor, right, A major, and it did all the key parts and everything. G. Yeah, it would, and it was sort of keep its own time and loop to itself. And it, now for the drum really breaks and stuff, were you switching the beat back and forth, or was it, it just, 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 it's just, just different it? breaks for? Yeah, wow. it's just okay. yeah, it's really weird. And basically. It sounds like a huge production, yeah. but it's just, it's just. <laughs> um, what's the name of that keyboard again? Uh, it's the 
called the Optagon, like Opti, like optical gun, G A N, Optagon organ, optical organ. It's sort of, I don't know, it's sort of like a combination between like a player organ, like you see Grandma having. A, it's sort of like that meets a Mellotron meets meets Mattel children's keyboard kind of thing. All right, go to the next one. And the next one is? Uh, this is Retribution. Retribution Gospel Choir playing the same song. you got to turn it up real loud. I brought this seven inch 45, whatever you want to call it. I brought some of those and it's got that. I don't want to wear Mimi singing, the R&B sounding. Right. So um, we've just got a few minutes here to open it up to questions from the oh, audience. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's right. I forgot the question. That would have been better. 